You're not gonna believe what happened. I found an artifact. <laughs> That's funny too, when you think about it in retrospect. Nice simple country road like thousands here in eastern North Carolina. I'm going up here, uh, not thinking today is going to be anything special. Everything's closed down, locked up in crops. Old country roads, uh, some of you have good stories about old country roads. This is the uh, high rise, the back section of high rise. There's an Indian site here. It just hasn't been farmed in a while. I guess they haven't needed it. I know it's right here though, oh, right under my feet. I found an incredible artifact. I'm walking up here, uh, collecting myself, getting my bag together. I knew I had a handful of artifacts I found and couldn't film in the last couple days. Really good stuff. I'm just going to go ahead and put it on film. But I'm walking up here and uh, you can see right here, that's my footprint. So I step right here and I said, ah, another piece of quartz and there's so much of it. And this is how it worked out. I checked it. It's an incredible point. I'm, I'm shocked because, you know, I just, you know, when you get to expect certain, certain ways, you should never expect things and never not check things. So I went down there and I said, man, I'm going to have to check it. Good thing I did. Before we, we, we check it, because I mean, look at it. From here you say, oh, maybe it's an airhead. But no, it, it looks like a piece of uh, quartz. It's white. So I don't trust white quartz anymore. Not around in, right on top of an Indian site. Look at this. Look at this. Yesterday, or the day before, I mean, I was just finding tips out in site four. Tips that were good enough where I was just not going to leave them. Keep moving forward. So when you're finding tips like this, uh, soon enough they're going to be all together somewhere. It's going to work out. But then there was these that I found. So quickly that I couldn't film them. The one on the left came from Cross Creek. Site two in the tobacco yesterday. It was only there for half an hour. I mean, look at that. And the one on the right, that came from North Gillfield. Incredible piece. See the serrations on that? So maybe what I found in the road here might be an indication of uh, something great today. Let's check it out. I flipped it out and I stuck it back in. I was so shocked. All right, that's how it went. Little old weed here. We're talking about simple old country road leading to crosslands. So I started digging. I just flipped it out. I said, oh my word. I mean, can you even believe it? Oh my word. I was so shocked. See, I mean, uh, don't trust a step when you're right on top of a place you know they were. Because as I said yesterday, in that long display video, uh, there are thousands laid upon thousands of, uh, look at how long it's been there. That's just dirt caked on there. Such a position where you just couldn't break it, not even with super heavy equipment. I mean, that's, it was in there. And it didn't look like that. I mean, we had dirt. You couldn't even see the thing. Well. That's just God for you to open up things. As you can see, oh, I'm gonna circle right back up in this site because that, that earned an extra five minutes. I'll circle right back up through these weeds and I don't know, I don't know. Decent hobby, right? Decent hobby. If you didn't take all the time in the world to watch the display video uh, last, uh, if you want just to relax and check out some artifacts, go back, 
you'll see why uh, I just don't know. I, I just get blown away. My word. Appreciate you all turning into Indian Trace. Doing the best I can.